Lyudmila Samsonova is a Russian tennis player. She was born on November 11, 1998 in Olnegorsk, Russia. Their family moved with the then one year old Lyudmila to Italy. Her father Dimitri, a table tennis player, was invited to play for the club Ferentino based in Torino. Her father asked her to start playing either table tennis or lawn tennis, choosing the latter. She started playing tennis at the age of six, joining Ricardo Piedi's Tennis Academy in San Remo after the local tennis federation helped her financially with that. In July 2021, she explained the reason behind her decision was the extra pressure of competing for the Italian national team, a country where tennis is more followed than in Russia, where she feels like competing only for herself, especially considering her boom-boom, hard-hitting game style. At the 2020-21 Billy Jean King Cup, Samsonova led the Russian team to their first title since 2008, winning all five of her matches in both singles and doubles. She won her first WTA Tour title at the 2021 German Open, a WTA 500 title, in June 2021 and has overall won three singles titles on the WTA Tour. She has also won a tight total of six titles on the ITF circuit. In 2022, Samsonova began her season at the Melbourne Summer State 1 but suffered a first-round defeat to former top-10 player Andrea Petkovic. The Russian reached her first quarter-final of the season at the Adelaide International 2 but lost to Madison Keys. At the Australian Open, Samsonova beat qualifier Emina Bechtus in the first round, reaching the second round for the second consecutive year. In 2021, contesting the main draws of the Canadian Open and the Western and Southern Open for the first time in her career, Samson Uber recorded a good win over top 20 player Alina Rebekina but lost to Sara Saribes, Tormo and Victoria Azarenka respectively. Samsonova won her first main draw match at the U.S. Open over Katie Bolter. In 2021, Samsonova returned to the tour at the Miami Open, where she qualified for the main draw with consecutive wins. In the first round of the main draw, she beat fellow hard-hitting Camila Giorgi in straight sets. She then earned the biggest win of her career over world number 11 Kiki Bartas after losing just three games, reaching the third round of a WTA 1000 event for the first time in her career. Samsonova lost to Maria Sakari eventually. In 2019, Samsonova started the year with her Grand Slam debut at the Australian Open but was defeated in the second qualifying round by Karolina Mukova, choosing to compete in higher level WTA tournaments with her ranking. The Russian fell in the qualifying rounds of premier tournaments in St. Petersburg, Doha and Dubai. In 2013, Samsonova made her professional debut at consecutive ITF circuit tournaments in Umag but lost both her singles matches. Samsonova reached her highest ITF junior ranking on 18 July 2016, peaking at the 65th spot on the rankings. Her biggest achievements were winning consecutive ITF junior circuit grade 2 tournaments in 2016, defeating notable players such as Kaho Jivan and Marta Kostiak. In October 2021, Samsonova clarified she has never had an Italian citizenship and thus has never faced the option of choosing between the two flocks. Lyudmila admitted that if her parents had stayed in Russia, she would have chosen figure skating. She speaks Italian as a native language and English as a second one, and her Russian is surprisingly good considering a lack of practice.